Warning, what I'm about to show you is a little cringeworthy. This is no pimple popping. That's pus oozing from eyelid ducts. Look closely, you see that? This is a procedure known as a meibomian gland expression. Optometrist Dr. Cam Solani is in our procedure room right now preparing patient Ivani for the big squeeze. So what is going on and how does pus end up in these, these little ducks to begin with? Hey guys, so we got patient Ivani here. She's hooked up <laughs> to the heated tear care system. This is a wonderful device in order to get the meibomian glands from a toothpaste expression down to an olive oil consistency. Very important, the root cause of most eye discomfort comes from these glands being obstructed or clogged. This can lead to things like red eyes, irritation, contact lens intolerance, and even styes. The temperature is up to the optimal therapeutic degree. And next thing we're gonna do is kind of get her into the system and get the pimple popping portion going. How do these glands get full of this pus-like material and how often does it happen? This can happen because of bacterial overgrowth, eyelash lice, makeup, eyeliner, Cosmetics can be a big component to this. Improper care of your contact lenses. We like to highlight the importance of daily use contact lenses to prevent that, that build of your own natural oils. Uh, this obstruction essentially causes uh, issues in about 40 million patients, at least in the US. And yeah. traditionally, over-the-counter drops and prescription drops help to target the symptoms, but not really the root cause. Uh -huh. And the only way to really get rid of the root cause is by using these kinds of technologies like tear care in order to un unclog the glands. So I know you're just prepping right now. We're going to pop in <laughs> in just a little bit to see this take place. If you have dry, red, or itchy eyes, you may have clogged eyelid ducts like patient Ivani, who's ready to pop up with the optometrist, Dr. Cam Salani. So earlier in the show, I know you prepped Ivani's eyelids with a warming pad as well as anesthetic drops. So what comes next, Doc? Well, let's get started. Cool. Let's get the ooze out. Yeah. <laughs> She's right. So Ivani, I'd like you to start by looking up for me. Mm -hmm. So ideally, we're looking again for that clear olive oil consistency. If we see any goop coming out, there he is. So that toothpaste-like material sits inside the glands and can permanently damage the precious meibomian gland. So very important to clear them out. What is the purpose of your meibomian glands? So the tear film has three layers. It helps to support the oily component of your oil glands. There it is. Oh yeah. Oh, okay. So this buildup just sits in there and causes obstruction, that redness. These can lead to styes. And again, contact lens intolerance. So really important to get rid of all that. And, and Dr. Kim, you said that, that ideally these glands should be secreting a more clear, oily-like substance, correct? That's correct, guys. So you can sit back, Ivani. Thank okay. you. Okay, cool. So really important to kind of keep them in a healthy state. A lot of times patients feel immediate relief. Sometimes patients need repeated treatment to get that ultimate outcome that we need. Um, hopefully after today's session, we'll complete the rest of the treatment in a little bit. After we complete all four eyelids, patient will have more comfortable contact lens experience. Uh, we don't suggest patients do this at home. We want to make sure to go to a properly trained eye doctor. And uh, things that they can do at maintain for maintenance at home or to enhance the effects of what we do in the office are things like omega-3 supplements, cleaning your makeup off properly, and uh, warm compresses. Yeah. So, <laughs> Warm compresses can sometimes be a little difficult for patients to do at home as far as compliance is concerned. Mm -hmm. So we see patients more frequently for repeated treatments. The treatment that we did today is usually recommended to do every six months or so. And, um, but patients are welcome to come in sooner. Thanks so much for sharing, Dr. Cam and Yvonne. We hope you feel better. I do, already. That's awesome. <laughs> Good old my body and glands. That's right. I mean, that's fascinating. That is to watch, it and it's is. just so satisfying. Anytime you express- You like it when it just comes- I love it. I, I'm one of those people. Are you? I, I confess, I like it. Wow. We'll be right back. <laughs>